actually in pretty decent shape here. There's that. Oh! The Conjurer's Wheel. Did we get? Flamenco? Wait! Ho ho ho! The Dancing Synergy! Do we do this now? I think we might do this next turn. I think we want to keep the dancing zombies on the field. So let's do this one. Give me another dancer. Fighter start. Flamenco! Wait! This is gonna do six! What is going on? It's lethal! Wait, this is four? That is god amazing! That was so good! <laughs> What's going on everybody? This is Fry. So today I'm gonna show you the double RNGesus deck. This is amazing. RNG, of course, stands for Random Number Generation, which is the same thing as luck in video games. And uh, this is actually the double RNGesus deck because there is two types of independent luck that we've used in the past for the zombies that we're doing in this deck. So one of them is evolving. Uh, we're actually running the interdimensional zombie. This will turn, again, into a higher cost guy. Uh, it'll turn into a random three cost card when you, have si when you play a science card, which we have plenty. Uh, and we're also running in this deck the transformation station so you can get your cards to even... Uh, become another, you know, step, another random zombie at one cost higher, and at the end of the day, you can even evolutionary leap them, which will make them uh, one cost higher. So there's some games that we really use this effectively, and you can get your little one cost cards that end up costing like these seven, eight, nine zombot, whatever it is. Uh, that's one strategy. The other strategy is with the Doctor Who and the Conjuring. Uh, of course, Dr. Spacetime, not only does he conjure cards himself, random cards, but any card that you conjure uh, will cost less. So you start playing just, you know, the Cosmic Scientist, and uh, we're actually going to be getting some uh, tricks and treats and <laughs> tricks and treats out of the Trick or Treater and the, uh, and, and the, and the Mad Chemist, uh, which is, again, really amazing. Pogo Mix of Gravedigger is really good, uh, just to add some stability and some removal to the deck. The Mix of Gravedigger, obviously, is also uh, random. Uh, gets some, also some random uh, removal tricks with the Thinking Cap helps you control. And the Fake Finish, of course, is the most random, the big card in the game. It is the Bad Moon Rising. So uh, this was a lot of fun. We had so much fun with this in the stream. Uh, and this deck actually was pretty good, too, so... Hope you guys enjoy. Uh, I just wanted to give a quick shout out. I started a brand new YouTube channel for those of you who don't know yet. Uh, it is called Frime Up Gaming. The link is in the description below. If you enjoy the videos on Plants vs. Zombies Heroes, I urge you please at least try one time. Uh, go over to Frime Up Gaming and check out the videos over there. Uh, I think you guys will really like them. Anyway, enjoy the video, you guys. <laughs> That's pretty good. I think we're gonna, should we keep a Bad Moon Rising? Hmm, I think we kind of need it to win. Let's get rid of that. Well, it actually works well with this. Hmm, okay, this is all right. Come on, Super! Come on, Super! Oh, come on. All right, this is pretty good. This is a good distraction. Uh, this will actually take some of the heat off of the Doctor Who next turn. Makes it more likely that Doctor Who's gonna be able to hit. See, there you go. That would've killed Doctor Who, so now <laughs> use it on our one drop. See you later, folks. It's super again, super. That was a signature power. Come on, man. Turns out pretty good so far. Fryhard Gaming. I almost named the new channel Fryhard. It was close, you guys. Does this go here? Is there any reason to put this on the ground? Yeah, we kind of want block meter manipulation and stuff. Why would HG be better than RNGesus than Super Brains? I think RNG, I think RNGesus decks are supposed to be fun, and he's just a more fun hero. His powers are a lot more fun, particularly all of his powers. He has like environments for powers and guys and all kinds of. He's just a weird hero. And his super is amazing in this deck. This deck for sure, the super is amazing. You get Pogo mix of Great Digger and Bad Moon Rising early. Over. And let's see what happens here. Oh, let's put this on the ground. Put it on the ground. Keep it on the ground. Give me something cheap. Let's go. Cheap. Teleport. What's that there? Should we use this for a card? Perhaps. Anything we really want to teleport in in this deck? Not really. We can teleport in a Doctor Who at some point if we get one. I don't know. Do it. It's free. We're not going to really have any... What the heck is this? No, it still survives. That's good. So we're gonna. What would we? What card could we use right now? We're probably gonna end up doing this next turn. 
I think I'm going to save it. It'll be a good trick for the mad chemist or something like that. Not bad, actually. Boink. Alright, these teleports are very good with the mad chemist and, the, and everything. His friends. So we could think and cap this turn. Other play is to play this and this. I think we can always do that later. Let's go thinking cap, and that might actually protect our Doctor Who somehow. We get super brains one. These will cost zero as long as he doesn't kill this. Which he's probably not going to invest another card to kill this. Nothing does. I'm good. Come on, we need Zmax super. That's what we want. Just two copies of Z-Max Super will be fun. Let's go! It's in the box! Okay, here's our first bit of luck. Let's go! Yes! Oh! Look what I found! <laughs> yes! That's perfect! That was absolute perfect. You know, he's gonna get one Punish Room shot. I do not want this thing dying yet. So we're gonna do it like this, actually. Oh, yeah, boy. <laughs> <laughs> wow, pretty good. Three points. Three points on the old luck score. We are surviving! I really wanted that to survive, so. Get more of these. Alright. So these aren't gonna survive here. Oh, wait, no, see, this one survived. We can actually do the transformation station here now. Uh. <laughs> Alright, let's see what we get. Well, let's do one of these. See what happens. Calling in transformation station in two. Some more value out of this. Supernova Garg. That might come in handy. We could teleport this one in. We'll see what happens. They see me increasing. Is there anything we would want to teleport in right now? We can teleport in this guy. Eh, let's just do this. Doctor, who's gonna die though? No! RNG thickens. Come on. Ugh, this doesn't help, does it? Because everything's dying for sure here. I'll do that later. Uh -huh. Yes! You missed me! <laughs> Alright, so this turns into a three drop now. There we go! Give me something good! Give me something good! Loud mouth. That's not bad. Not bad at all. I think we're gonna do this and teleport in Super Guard. Supernova Guard. Supernova. We have Bad Moon Rising next turn, actually. What's in the box right now? I hope he plays Pine Clone. Play Pine Clone. Okay, we got the chopper, the five cost. And, uh, alright, teleport card. I hope he plays Pine Clone. That would be so good. Play Pine Clone. Just throw it for the stream. Blueberry. Don't kill that. Piece of garbage. Uh. Friday. Friday, gotta get going with Friday. I think this one is the dangerous one. <laughs> Don't mess with Supernova Guard, yeah, guys. This will be a 3 1. Now. We're doing okay. We're kind of running out of speed, but whatever. <laughs> Shut up. Now yeah, what? Meh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Gotta take advantage of the transformation station, you guys. Hope he plays an environment here, because we have two to play. Stop playing Punish Room! What the heck is this? Okay. <laughs> Uh-oh, this Punish Room's a problem. Gotta get a block. Let's go. Uh, go face. Go face. Oh, yes. <laughs> Here we go. Here we go, folks. All right, so this is going to turn to a five and a six. Huh? Oh, no. We have no block meter. This is not good. Huh? Huh? Okay. <laughs> okay. 
And, ooh, defensive end, not bad. Oh, I have mixed up Grave Digger. Does that help? Can't Bad Moon Rising, unfortunately. Three and five. Oh, that was pretty good. Can Grave Buster, though. Hmm. I don't think putting things in gravestones is smart here. Two damage just kills us, though. That's the problem. Berry Blast wins. I think it's three and four. There you go. I'm a helicopter. And we have the bounce, which is great. Problem is, if he grave busts now, we, we lose, but I guess that's inevitable. Inevitable. Uh huh? No berry blast! <laughs> what the heck is that? It's a reincarnation. Carnation! And there's Starge Lord? That's all he's doing? Wait, are we gonna win? <laughs> That's lethal! And <laughs> moron! This is Bullseye! This is so good! <laughs> Look at that! And thank you so much, Gramster the, the Sixth, for t just subscribing to Twitch Prime. You guys have Amazon Prime, you get the free Twitch sub every month. Thank you so much. We're using on the stream. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, that game was really tense. I did not think we were going to win that game. He could have just had a berry blast and beaten us. <laughs> we get extra points on the win there for him not having berry blast. So nine points total. That's what I'm talking about. Nothing unlucky happened. Let her early. Nothing unlucky. It was amazing. This defensive end might have saved us there. I don't even know. Got him. All right. <laughs> Pretty good. Well, this isn't really necessary. <laughs> um. All right. Looks good to me. Super. Okay. So two, three, four. You think you'll get ultimate tomorrow or soon? I don't know. I'm not really racing the ultimate. I used to think getting ultimate was a big deal, but now we always have so much time to get it that no one even cares. All right, I want some little tricks. Let's go. We just need some barrel barrels and stuff like that from these, uh, from these Doctor Who's. The sad potato mine is real. Boom. Boom, shakalaka. Goes right here. Gonna use our environment. We're gonna conjure two cards this turn. Hopefully, they're gonna be good ones. Wow, we got the thinking caps. The thinking cap works so well with these. <laughs> Come on. Get matched up. Don't go dry. There you go. Pepe. He's bubbling it here. Not even close. Not even close. Nice try. Okay, conjuring two. They're going to get double discounted too. Come on. Give me things that cost like four, three, two. That's fine. That's free now. I'd rather more expensive cards. He thinks it costs like four or five things. <laughs> Yay, we got the environment! Perfect. Alright, now what are we doing? We could go with you. Yeah, it's thinking cap. Then we'll get some mad chemist value. Some mad chemist value. Plus, it's possible. Thinking cap. I love thinking cap. Super brains. Ah. <laughs> uh, and Immortitia's super, eh? So we can m put Immortitia's super here, and it'll break through. And well, it's not bad. So should we super brains here? Why the heck not? <laughs> More cards! <laughs> Go, get them! <laughs> Kill that guy. Ooh, a ninja. I want to be a ninja. That happened. <laughs> so much fun. So this will draw another card. Do we play this one for some reason? Make Doctor Who live, like, forever? Eh, why not? So we're going to go pirate, and we could have saved one of those for the chemist. Eh, who cares? No one. Oops! Oops, what did I just do? I forgot about this guy's power. I'm so dumb. I thought it would make my Doctor Who survive longer. Whoa. I just never see this card. I just forgot what it does. Come on, Fry. Come on, partner. What are you doing? 
What is this guy doing? What is he doing, folks? That was insane. Why would I do that? That was borderline insanity. I think we're gonna leap this turn. I do this. <laughs> it's free. Classic brain fart. Yeah, I know. This is still gonna freeze something. Wow, we. Oh, we freeze now. What are we leaping? I think we'll do this. Freeze that one. Keep that alive. Called being stupid. Which? What do we leap now? What do we leap right now? Three. Two L. This one. Give me something good! Ooh! Team Nazca. Not bad. Give me a one health. Yes! The one cost is real. Here we go. So now this survives. <laughs> the treats are real, you guys. Oh, we got things to get. Nice. Professor Brain Fart is right. What did I just do to him? Stupid. <laughs> you missed me. Go team mascot. That was nice. So you go two and four, and then use the tree and all the powers and stuff. So we can go four and two. You want to leap something? Leap this one. I want to leap this. Is playing this card better than leaping something? I guess we do want to leap this right now. Actually, the tr the powers could help this. Eh, let's do this. Let's get some immediate Doctor Who cares value. That's not bad. Bullseye, this thing. Well, that'll come in handy later. Bad Moon Rising, what, next turn? And get the buff. Alright, well, these are free now. And we'll get a treat, which hopefully will be the free variety. Yes, here's this. Yes, got the free one. So this is one and three. Three doesn't help you. Uh, we probably will play gravestone somewhere, cause why not? We'll just do it on this one. Do it on Doctor Who. No, let's do it on this one. Doctor Who's less good now. Gotcha. It's in the box. Batman Rising, very nice. Uh, we'll pull off this, cause this is the one that dies unnecessarily. <laughs> it's Bad Moon Rising time, yeah, guys. So here's a zero cost guy. Yeah, we're just gonna Bad Moon Rising next turn. Got him. This will pop out. This is somewhat protected. The treats are real. And it's turn seven. Very nice. And thank you so much, Sherlock Grange. <laughs> thank you so much. That is so generous of you. Sherlock Grange with the $15 donation. Thank you. Really, really appreciate it. Here we go. It's a, I don't know what kind of deck he's running. Seatro even runs that card. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna conjure a card out of this, popping out of the gravestone again. And and got that. Okay. Here we go. Oh wait. Oh yeah. This this uh, active ability. Let's go. Uh, it doesn't matter. If it would have had an active ability, we could have gotten some value there. But here we go, you guys. <laughs> Give me something good. <laughs> Wannabe hero, that's pretty good. So the wannabe hero is amazing. This is not good, but this is actually gonna now make a make a guard since this dies. So this is okay. This was about mm, Is this good? I haven't been keeping track of luck score. This is decent. I'm gonna give my I'm gonna give myself two points because it's not amazing. Really nothing unlucky has happened so far. This this unfortunate this third one was really bad. The wannabe hero was good. You know what? I'm gonna give myself three points of luck score and one point of unluck just because. Gotta get the unluck on the board. Just because. Look at this. This is so cool. This is 13. Now what do we do? Another bad moon rising. I don't want to get master grave blaster. That would be really bad. We can leap this one. <laughs> I 
Let's do this. I feel like doing Mad Chemist. Just for BM value, you guys. Oh, yes. Oh, no. <laughs> Oops. I think we're going to leap this one to... I, it's either Octo or Plank Walker. Uh, I think it's this one. How do you put seedling here? I think it's this one. <laughs> Come on. Plank Walker. Come on, Gondola. Come on, Gondola. Yes. Good game. And we got Rolling Stone. Very nice. Oh, the Rolling Stone is really good there. We had a little yeah, hibernating berry on the field and we got Rolling Stone. That was amazing. Six points. Six points you go. Oh, he's dead. This man is dead. He's deaf. <laughs> oh no, he's gonna make it rain. Seedling's gonna attack us. What else? Whatever are we gonna do, you guys? Here comes Seedling. Watch it. <laughs> Yo, Dad. Gondola for the finish. That is what I'm talking about. <laughs> 21. We have 21 points. That's right. Plus, we gotta see Seedling attack, which is always amazing. It's always a mess in this, guys. I think we're missing this deck as any proper insidious minions, but whatever. <laughs> um, that's not bad. Alright, we're gonna go this route. I haven't really seen Interdimensional Zombie get much playtime yet. Uh, this is a science card, right? Yeah. Oh, the science is real. So nothing really on turn one can take can do three damage. If our opponent goes after this, if one of these hit, we're gonna actually play this. Hmm. Do we risk this getting very blasted? I guess we should just play this immediately. These little things charging our block meter, that's actually good for us. Alright, we'll do this immediately so this thing doesn't get very blasted. We want the value first. If it gets very blasted, we're not gonna have a play, that's the problem. So now we'll be able to just play environments or whatever next turn. Come on, give me something good. Give me, um, the best thing is usually just Captain Deadbeard, which also only has three health. So I'm gonna four line dancing up. Come on, man! Really? Really, that just happens? Okay, let's not die to Scorch, I guess. Whatever. Alright, that's impossible. <laughs> Stupid! No! Bad luck! That was the worst thing. I mean, it's gonna do a little face damage, but still. What is this guy doing? He's setting up the Pine Clone? Setting up Pine Clone right now. Being really stingy on this Pine Clone. Super! Let's do it here, because it trades well. It's only just environment and environment here. We might just play this one if something weird happens. This dies now. We can leap and play the environment. Come on! Give me something good. Yes! Stop it on! Oh! That's what I'm talking about. That is what I'm talking about. Yeah, boy! Wait, now every card we draw is gonna be. We could actually draw a card with teleport here. That was amazing! Come on. Give me a minion. Yes! 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 And the teleport also buffs the stuff. Now we can do this and teleport. That is amazing. Wait a second. Now what do we do? Do this and teleport, I suppose. <laughs> Look at this four or five. I'll definitely take it. Here's this. He's leaving my stomping on really. Gotta have something for it. And very blessed day. Well, we'll do this together. It's a free treat. Yeah, guys. <laughs> Don't mess with the treat value. Eat him up. Please do trade. Too bad we didn't really have an environment play there. Look at this. 8-8. Eight, eight. <laughs> That's pretty good. What do I do here? This is really annoying. Is this going to lose its stats? What do I do here? I don't know. Just 
play the 8 8 on the field to sign. They don't really need the 8 8. No, it's just. They don't really have any other plays. I mean, we could buff this up and then. Then what, though? Next turn, we can pogo and play a treat or something. You think plant RNGs Jesus is more fun? Eh. Dang, trick or treat, it loses his buff. Stomp it on is for not. Oh, let's go with this. Let's go with this hitting the trick or treater is probably the best thing, actually. Dang, killed that. Come on, man! Stupid. This station is pretty good. 2 2 and 2. Yeah, let's go with this. Give me something good. Something cheap would be nice. Not cheap. A plank walker. Warlord better than Stampedon confirmed. Oh, here, whatever. What is this? Really? I'm gonna buff these all up somehow? Hammer! Dang. Give me something good. Bats, really? Really now? That is useless. <laughs> Just in case. No. Oops, I should have wait for freeze. I'm stupid. That's called being stupid. Why would I play that? Should have played it here. Go. Now the bats live. Good cards. Oh, nice. No, this is not going well. Not good, you guys. Not good. What are we gonna do here? We probably should have actually held that for this turn. How do we win? Bad luck! Must have been all bad luck, you guys. I misplayed with the transformation station there, but it doesn't matter. We were not going to end up playing it anyway. Come on, man. What's that? Uh, this is actually the play. We actually can survive here now. Gotta do this. Now this could hit this and not kill us. It's possible to survive, you guys. Come on, hit the pogo, hit the pogo! Yes! <laughs> We're alive! <laughs> the luck is real. One point. Now what? We need some healing. <sighs> Two, four. This is gonna have to save us. We need some healing or something. No berry blast. Shut up. One point for Gryffindor. <laughs> I actually have a point system in this Perry Potter. Come on. Dang, that's striking. Wait, that's stupid. Now this can mess yourself up. Pine clone. Wait. Yes. Oh, come on. Wait. Oh. Oh. Hold on. We back. Here we go. Oh, it's doable. Wow, that strike through was the problem. Come on. Give me something good. Give me something good. Minions. Uh. Oh. Uh oh. <laughs> this is the real Iron Jesus. It's really going down. No, I got Plague Walker. No, no. Uh, nah, that's game. What could this do? Could this heal us? <laughs> Always get loud now. <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> no! <laughs> A tense sequence there at the end. For not. 
Or not yet, guy. Did this guy even kill us? I don't even know what kind of deck that was. Molokel. He got Molokel into Pine Club. Wrong order, man. Stupid. <laughs> this is good. It's pretty good, I think. Let's get rid of this one. This will be fun. This will be so much fun. I'm just gonna grow these guys. That's how this is going. <coughs> no, Primal! Really? Really? He had Primal, but who runs that card? Come on, man. Come on, partner. Go. <laughs> Go. <laughs> The, the guy doesn't get bullseye, but whatever. It's a walnut. Great. Ooh, one of these. We're gonna play. Might leave this. I wonder, actually. No, wow, wait, look at this guy. Give me something good! Yes! 3-3. Three, three. Eh, that's average. That's 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 actually slightly above average. <laughs> if getting a random three without any powers, not really good. <laughs> Here goes this one. Ooh! Alright, well that's in the station, so we'll just buff this. We'll just invest in this thing. Here's this now. You can always leap leap the uh, loudmouth here. Yeah, we'll just invest in this one. So it's gonna be yeah, anyway. Okay. So we want to transformation station. Thank you so much, Kamatan. Eighty-eight to fifty-seven is my pick for luck. <laughs> You're predicting. The predictions are real, you guys. Okay. So here's this. Okay, here's the play. Two. Now this becomes a thing. High diver. Okay, it doesn't really matter. And yeah, we'll use this. Why not? Actually, we can do this next turn, so it'll freeze the pair cut. Yeah, why not? All right, so this is coming a four. These are both becoming four drops now. We're going into turn four with a five four and two random four drops. <laughs> Pretty good. Oh, it's turn five. You know what I'm saying? Hey, it leaps. Done, 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 done. Perfect, perfect. And it's a kangaroo. So we're gonna just gonna leap things and play this. So this goes in the middle. Oh no, it's onion ring. Say it isn't so. All right, so we're going to we're going to leap this one first, just because we need this one to survive. This one is okay. Mix up grave digger. No, no, no! They ruined everything. You stupid mixed up grave digger. You stupid digger. Piece of trash. Why? Ditch digging piece of garbage, you useless ditch dig. <laughs> you just dig graves, that's all you do. Piece of trash garbage. I'm taking off five points. I ruined our whole thing. I ruined our whole thing, you guys. They're great, wonderful. Yay, we get that first, wonderful. This is useless. Why did that could not have gone worse? That could not have gone worse, you guys. Unbelievable. Okay, this happens. Okay, so I guess we... Actually, no, I guess we'll freeze this one. Let's leap this one since it's the least value. Don't give me another mix of grave digger. I'm going to kill something. Okay, yeah, so this survives now. So let me do it like this. And like this. Perfect! <laughs> Boink. I'm surviving! Alright, so this turns into a six, and this turns into a six. Here we go! Give me something good now! Come on, man. Now we might mix up Grave Digger, actually. <laughs> coffee! That doesn't really help. We could mix up Grave Digger to do the coffee value, though. And it turns into. Ooh, that's not bad. I think this and Leap. Whee! <laughs> I hope he's not running Grave Blaster, though. That would. 
Eh, no one even runs that card. Alright, we'll get another shot out of coffee zombie. I want coffee to be in four. Let's go. Or we're gonna leap something. <laughs> this game's fun! <laughs> we're just mix up grave digger leap. Yes, coffee's in four! Yeah, boy! Oh, just coffee being in four is so significant. It buffs everything now. With the 1 1 frenzy. It's just a going viral play. No, I like no blockbuster, please. Okay, the roots are kind of real. Okay, that happened. It's gonna explode. Wait, you're gonna kill your pair cub, dude. Wow, that was a bad play. This lives. This lives. So what do we leap now? What do we leap right now? I think this is the weakest one. This will turn to a seven drop. Sevens are usually gonna survive here. Right? Right. Go! It's a 5 4. It's the weakest one. <laughs> it's a wannabe hero! Now that has 21 health. <laughs> 21! 21. Go! Yeah, it died. <laughs> Everything has frenzy too. This has got to be lethal, you guys. Yeah, it's lethal. I can't do anything here. Got him! Got him! Oh, look, he's gonna throw the rumble. It does nothing. It clank lug. Everyone, I'm mean, these huge guys. It's like, I have 21 health, okay? No one cares. Oh, it's not lethal yet? Oh, this one didn't. I forgot he's protected. Oh, okay. It's a one off. <laughs> we have... Yes! Gotta leave! <laughs> yes, let's get through to an eight! We're gonna get the Zomba play! Here we go! <laughs> Plank Walker, come on, Gondola! Let's go! Come on, Gondola! No, Swabby, I want Swabby! Yes! Swabby will save us! Swabby's lethal, by the way, you guys. Come on, play this through. I need to get the. I need to get the. Don't concede. Don't concede. Don't concede. Yes, he's gonna play this out. <laughs> the luck is increasing rapidly this game. Don't concede. Don't concede. Don't, don't you think, think about conceding. Don't even think about it. I need to get Zamba. I want Zamba. Come on. No, no, don't say Doom Shroom. Sure. Don't even say that, you guys. He doesn't have it. Come on. Just, just don't, don't concede. Don't, don't concede. <laughs> no, okay. Don't concede. That was the wrong one. Wrong one. Don't concede. Don't concede. <laughs> Yeah, boy! Oh, we need to end up with the full field, too. Okay, now we can see it. Whee! Got him! Got him! That was so good! That was so great! He was a good sport. I'll definitely take it. I'll definitely take it. The, the mix of Grave Digger died, so... Ah, that was fun. I wish we could have won with Swabby. That was the only thing that match was missing. We need the Swabby victory. Come on, guys. Well, I make that, that... It's just so frustrating, you know, for Bad Moon Rising. For fun players, basically. It's not even an OP strat, you know? Oh, Bad Moon Rising. And that you need to nerf it with Mix of Grave Digger in there. Anyway, <clears throat> this looks pretty good. We'll get rid of the leaf for now. Oh, it's not a bad hand. Super! Okay, pretty good. It's a very good decoy for the Doctor Who. It's a 2-3 Bullseye on 1. That's amazing. Uh, this still costs 1, right? Yeah. They sound like Immortitious Power since it's the trick that conjures it. The actual guy costs 3. Same with Spadows. But... And thank you, Think Kyle! Still mad at the top cheer glitch. Also, did you watch The Last Jedi yet? I had to advance tickets for it three months ago. Oh, thank you so much. No, I'm really not up to date with Star Wars, but I, I, I should get back into it. I should definitely get back into it. Gucci gang, how do you want? So thank you so much, Think Kyle. Wow, that's so generous. The generosity is real. It's the season that you're all awesome. La, 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 la. Anyway. <laughs> See how up to date I am. Uh, yeah, I know. I don't know why the top top cheer. It's really weird. What just happened, guys? He played pea shooter. Then he realized I'm using the wrong deck, and he quit. What the heck? All right, 
Seven points! Seven points of RNG! I don't know. That was his Christmas gift. He's giving out all of his stars. He's giving out his... He's giving away stars to everyone. The guy played pea shooter. This guy's drunk! That's why it's Christmas Eve. He's drunk. He's like, hey, I know a good... <laughs> I know a good idea. We're gonna put pea shooter in a deck. Oh, wait. I think I'm good. I can see now. See ya later. <laughs> Come on, man. Come on, man. He's running pea shooter. Easy peasy with the pea. Are there any strategy decks around pea shooter? Eh, <laughs> This, yeah, that's only good if you have Doctor Who. That's a pretty good hand. Come on, Super. Oh, I just want to play all this on turn two. That'll be amazing. Three stars. Let me start with this. Um, this is fine. Does Fry ever get drunk? No. Are you saying it? Do my spit down impression? <laughs> what the heck? Why does that always happen? It's so annoying. Run, run. Oh, that's a tap deck. That is a tap deck. I don't want this getting scorched, actually. I'm gonna put that right there. Alright. That shouldn't be coming up. Do, 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 do. Hmm, seems like my texts are coming up on the stream. I'll go fix that real quick. Die! It must be like a do not disturb mode or something like that. I think your text's not coming. Alright, that's fine. I don't think Transformation Station really has a place here. This is okay. What, is he gonna scorch this next turn? Do this. See what happens. I never really want to put this in an environment, right? Like final mission. Cost zero. I think we'll just final mission. Go. If he threatens my my Doctor Who this turn, then we'll maybe we'll just final mission. Sweet peas, evil. He's, he has scorch in his hand. I kind of played into it. Oh, really? Really now? The thing is, I want a transformation station this next turn. This is turn three. I wonder if I do this to make him not, not get any value. We could just start leaping the Doctor Who. I just kind of wanted to leap this one. Eh, that should be fine. It's free after all. Alright, let's, let's not let him get the stuff. Turns out to be good. Get him! Good final mission value. Pretty good final mission there, actually. Right, I'm gonna try to put my phone in Do Not Disturb mode like this. You guys are super, super generous. It's amazing. Wow, it's a five cost Discotron. What is going on? Holy moly with that. What is happening here? That's healing. That's amazing. Question is, do we want to leap? Thank you so much, Thing Kyle. I really, really appreciate it. You guys just keep me going here. You can realize how much your donations really... This is my full-time job, and I have, you know, kids and everything, and it's really... Five luck for the, for the donation. Five luck. That's right. Plus five luck for the donation. That's what I'm talking about. Which one of these do we play? It's this. Question is where. I think default, I'm just going to play it here. 
Wait, play it. Yes. Oh, I almost ran out of time. Okay, so this will trade. This is fine. And this will turn to a three. I suppose this is turning to a two. This is better. Ooh, pogey. I'm a vampire. <laughs> now what? Disco charm? It gets 200 luck. Well, I had five more. That's so nice of you. Here we go. Thank Kyle with the donations. Well, what do we do here? Pogan? He's probably gonna end up destroying something. I do bits work. But how does one go earning and donating them? You can buy them or you can watch ads for them. Look it up on Google. How to do that. Dang, oh no. We actually get value here, which is pretty cool. Huh. Interesting, so that dies. This keeps growing. <laughs> pretty good, actually. Alright, thanks for stopping by Ludo. We're actually in pretty decent shape here. There's that. Oh! The conjure's real. Let's see what we got. Flamenco? Wait! Ho ho ho! The dancing synergy! Do we do this now? I think we might do this next turn. Hmm. I think it's Pogo Leap for now. We'll probably leap this one. This is a six cost card, actually. Yep. What do we leap now? It can turn into a seven cost card, which is either a knight or mm, it's a bunch of good things. Four, four bullseyes and bad. We could leap this into a five, which will then usually kill the Captain Cucumber. We can leap this one. This is still doing damage to his face. I think we want to keep the dancing zombies on the field, so let's do this one. Give me another dancer. Give me binary star. Flamenco! Wait! This is gonna do six! What is going on? It's lethal! Wait, this is four? That is god amazing! That was so good! <laughs> what? <laughs> Someone actually called it in the chat, you can see. Someone said Leap Pogo into Flamenco. That was crazy! That was insane! <laughs> it must have been the good luck from the $200 donation, you guys. Wow, that was crazy. <laughs> 15 points. I don't even care. I don't even care. <laughs> Huge Giganticus is OP, you guys. <laughs> that was insane. <laughs> Come on, man. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. What just happened? <laughs> Alright, we'll go with this. Why is everyone spit out today? Everyone is spit out in Green Shadow. What is going on? So two and three. That's awfully good. Let's do an aggro evolution deck. Anyway, highlight. <laughs> That'll probably actually make the highlight of the video. So I write this down. Uh, um, this is one. Oh, what is this now? Can I go with you? I might go with the. Uh, uh, we'll see. That was crazy right now. Yeah, it, the Doctor Who's are gonna be better here. Doctor Who. Is Doing some damage here. Not so bad. Oh, the mustache, yay. Fun. So we can use the mustache instead now. Leap. It's going pretty good. If he plays an environment, one environment. If not, we'll probably just mustache. It's Fry said literally thing. I literally have that. One, two, two, four. What's that? Uh, 
Um, I think I'll actually do this so that both of them can. Got him. Block. Super, 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 super. Uh -huh, this works. <laughs> it's pretty good. It's all good. Now we get so many. We're getting three more cards. Four. Basically milled already. That costs two, by the way. It costs two. Uh, that's fine. It's also a science card, I think. Yeah, it is. All right, that costs one. <laughs> What's going on? What's going on? Oh, it's the grave digger. Okay, so I also get a teleport, just in case. That uh, costs zero. So it's one, two, and one. Maybe we'll go with this one. I really don't want to give him cards at this point. I think a random three is kind of better than this two. Alright, go with you. One, two, or we'll just freeze one of these, I guess. Brain Vendor! Ho ho ho! Wait! Now we can think and cap if we want! That is amazing! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, boy, four points. <laughs> Lucktown, welcome to Lucktown, you guys. Ah, uh, it's going on YouTube, yeah. Let's go. Wait, so now what do we do? So we can think and cap, we can leap something. Is Think Cap gonna help this though? He will freeze and leap. I like to freeze one of these, maybe. Think Cap's not bad here though. Eh, let's go for it. Let's see what happens. Come on, give me something good. Galvanize, perfect. We'll galvanize this one. <laughs> That's pretty good. That'll just draw us extra cards. And uh, teleport will come in handy later. Die! And... Whee! Cards! That's your treater! Nice, okay. Die! Okay, one of these, um, Doctor Who's gonna <laughs> proc the blow. Uh, we're milled. We're definitely milled. How much luck was that, by the way? Um... <clears throat> And there's another one of those. Very nice. We got triplication. Oh, <laughs> I thought it was thinking cap. Not bad. Hold on. So now we need it cheap as possible here. Three and two. Let's go with this. Just to cheap cheapify everything. Okay, I'll donate more helps. What is it? Say for I made a tempo deck? Oh, look at that for a second. Holy bubbling that now. Where? To there? Okay. <laughs> the 6-2 is such a big threat. We can actually freeze this. Oh, too bad trick-or-treater. Well, anyway. Okay. Oh, there we go. Leap something? What do we leap? Leap this? Well, this always happens. Is this, is this science? Maybe it is. Right, give me something good. Trick or treater! We actually got one! Yes! Yes! Now we can use the treat on this. Beautiful. Yeah, it's discounted. That's fine. Good. The treat goes here. <laughs> now what do we leap? Uh, I guess let's just leap this. We don't have room in our hand for the triplication. That's the problem. Yeah, let's just leap this one. What's in the box? God, Tankalosaurus. Very nice. Oh, that good. <laughs> that doesn't even matter. Wow, Tankalosaurus is so good with the triplication here. That's crazy. There's Thinking Cap. We're milled. Milled to the sky right now, but whatever. <laughs> right, that hit face down. <laughs> God, Tank. <laughs> this is amazing. Oh, look at this tempo deck, and okay, I'll, I'll look at a tempo deck right now. Tempo, tempo, I got some threes. Need Lily. Lily of the Valley is the thing missing from this deck. Um, can use Banana Source Rexes if we have them too. That would be nice. I don't think the um, Tough Beat would be better than the than the fives that you're running. So get rid of the, all those fives from the Tough Beats. And uh, you need a good four. So either Croc or, or Banana Source Rex. Everything else looks fine. 
<laughs> just kidding. <didn't> see. <laughs> Quick deck review there at the end of this lucky game. I'm doing so many things. I'm keeping track of the luck score and doing the game and looking at people's decks and looking at the chat and thanking people for the generous donations, which they're doing. I'm not complaining about that. But you guys are, yeah. All right. We won. You can see this. That was so good. That was so much luck. The fact we got trick or treat. I was like, oh no, we didn't play trick or treat, or we could have used a treat with freeze in lane one to make that survive and hit face, and it worked. And it worked. Uh, the beta caratina deck. Yeah, I didn't really. I don't know. There was nothing really exciting about that deck. Well, I guess so. I can I can upload that to YouTube. You know what? I need some more YouTube videos. So this one's a good one though. I like town. I like city. Well, it's all Spadown Green Shadow. I, have we played anyone else? I think we play one Solar Flare. Come on, man. Huh? Not much. Not many Bad Moon Risings today. We haven't really even needed them. Hmm. Maybe once in that. Okay. Well, we're gonna play this and just leap it. Leap to victory. There we go. The highlights are real. The highlights are insane. I'm wondering if more people are going to watch during Christmas or less. I'm going to keep track of that, actually. It's kind of a good information as a streamer. Right now, there seems to be above, slightly above average, actually. No, no, no. Easton. Let's just play this. If this dies, that's fine. If not, we'll have a good... Transformation Station, dude. Oh! Zamba! Now we just need some teleports. We'll get them from our teleportation station. That'll be fine. Got Zamba. That's that's okay. It's, it's one for... It's two for one. Look, we trade one card for one card, plus we get Zamba out of the deal. So, definitely work. Mr. Grave Digger. There we go. Pink Bananaster should actually be buffed. No way. Can't get Trick or Treater from Seedling anymore. No! An aggro evolution deck? I don't really understand what that means, but I don't think it's really going to be aggro. It's not going to be reliable. For aggro, you need reliable high attack cards. When you're evolving, I don't know which type to evolve. If you mean like Transformation Station evolves, so then. What is that? Okay, well, let's just do this. Please don't be bomb. Be anything but bomb. Anything but bomb is fine. Oh, that's good. That's good. Oh, 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 yes. That's a point of luck. It does an extra piece of damage this turn. So, whatever. That's probably going to be better than the four drop that comes out. So, whatever. Let's draw some cards. Give me something good. Give me something good. I knew it. I knew it. Oh, we're going to leap this. We can just double leap this, actually. We'll double leap it. Why not? Leap, leap. Army of Glass Cannons. Exactly. That's what an aggro deck is. Usually. An aggro control deck, sure. I think I actually had that once. It was an aggro control hybrid. I forget which hero that was for. Uh, I think our control Neptuno used to play very aggro. Um, or the imp control Neptuno. We used to play aggro against some heroes and control against others. Mountain Climber? It's fine. We're just going to leap it. We'll take off one point for the Mountain Climber. And thank you so much. Thank you. Anyone remember Pop Cap David or Dave? Dave. Dave from uh, the guy with the, with the, with the, this guy. It's Dave. Hey, look, I'm Dave. It's, it doesn't really work. You need more of a saucepan. Don't concede. I got a 2-2. Two -two. Just make a play. I need to leap this. Don't. Yes. Okay. Ah, uh, something good. Not mixed of grave thicker. I have a screen door shield. Worst one ever. Okay, goes to the six. Very nice. <laughs> Only at gas giant. Oh, we're gonna block and get super here. Watch this. Die. <laughs> That's pretty good. Um, did we play this card? I think I'll just play. Okay, now this turns into a seven. 
think the idea is to play mix of Grave Digger here. It's a wannabe hero. How are we at 11, by the way? It's a wannabe hero. This is just going to get frozen here. That's the problem. He could have Cool Bean. There's a pretty good chance of having Cool Bean. I think it's mixed up. I think so. I know, I know Cool Bean, but it's it's much more likely he has. He hasn't played any Freeze yet. It's way more likely he has a Freeze than has exactly a Cool Bean. So we're going to take that risk. I want to be here to actually be here now. Yes, because he'll kill this. Huh? He could block and get super big chill. Now he doesn't have the Cool Bean. He would have played it already. Want to be hero counter? It's pretty good. Uh, he doesn't have it, so we're good to go. And yes, this will actually kill the thing. No, no, don't play Cool Bean. Do not play Cool. Why is he taking so long in this turn? It's too tense. Just stop it. No one runs Cool Bean, okay? He's ranked 27. He doesn't even have that. Huh? Huh? Top Cap Devin is U Box, right? Right, right, right. And <laughs> that's what I thought. Oh, wow. He's doing, a, he's doing a lot of damage to us here. We could actually win with double ones. Um, he has 7 8. He's <laughs> got so many cards here. Wait, oh, he got. Oh, he, wait. Did he get Winter Squash from the thing? No, he didn't. Come on, roll one! <laughs> So close. This turns into a six now. Ooh, we are in trouble. Uh, I think it's got it's got to be Pogo this turn. Pogo this and and freeze. I think we'll have six. <laughs> this, we're go this is turn five, by the way, you guys. Don't ask me how we have this wannabe hero on the field. This guy takes so long. His internet connection sucks. Okay, down to three. This is tense. Bad Moon Rising. It's in the box. Oh, that's what I thought. That is what I thought. <laughs> All right, so this happens. This happens. And then just freeze. Wannabe Hero saves the day. <laughs> Watch him just have, like, I don't know, plant food. I don't even know what would help him here. <laughs> yes. Fry, how did you get that Wannabe Hero? I should have fry me. I should have fry me here just in case. Ugh, who here likes fry me? Let me know in the chat. Who here knows who fry me is? So say yes if you like him. No if you don't like him. I don't know if you have no idea who fry me is and you didn't watch the trailer. Come on, guys. Gotta watch the new channel trailer. It's a video in itself. Alsteroni, you're so cool. You're so cool for saying that. Undying fairy. That's right. You guys didn't see it. Wow, a lot of people go to YouTube and watch the trailer for the new channel. You'll go figure them out. You don't know? A lot of people don't even... How, why? Is it not suggested? It was only a two-minute video, so it could be it just wasn't suggested to a lot of people. Which is sad. And go. I, I'm, I'm going to put a little... Okay, just didn't see this. <laughs> Couldn't handle the pressure. I'm going to put a, a, another plug to the new channel. I guess I'll upload this video and I'll put a plug at the beginning. So, anyway. Boom! Got him! <laughs> Fry with the stupid wig. Go! Ranking it. Ranking it. Alright, how many more games do we have? Uh, one or two more. And thank you, Think Kyle. Is Fry Me a boy or a girl? Is Fry Me a boy or a girl? Um, I, I, I didn't really try to determine that. Um, I would say probably a... a I don't know. I mean, I have a beard, so I I I'm, I'm I pr actually really try to make Fry me pretty gender neutral. Um, actually, uh, it's just supposed to be like the Fry me is the. I'll explain Fry me. Fry me is the Fry me is the nickname that my mother actually used to call me when I was a kid. Just go, oh Fry me, and so Fry with, with my things like Fry, so Fry, fry me used to be the, the the name. So that's like the little 
like dumb version of me slash encompassing you know care encompassing like every stupid comment on youtube basically <laughs> that's that was the idea but um no i didn't assume anyone's done did i see what i did there okay one of these are good two is a little too much yeah. pretty good decoy value even if you use a super on this, it's fine, because it just makes it so much better. I might play this on heights if he doesn't show us a superpower this time. That's okay. You know what? This becoming zero attack is not that much of a problem. Geyser. I think this is the way. Right, because he's not, if he doesn't kill this, we're still going to be getting value out of this later. Come on, don't give me a Morticia's Bats. Watch him have Scorch here. So stupid, I hate getting Bats. Bats should not exist. Bats are dumb. Hey, he's giving me the Karth? He's just fronting that? And now he kills it. Right. What is with these little party time? Wait, is he going to get the Doctor Who? Oh, that wasn't a very good play. What are your PC specs? I'm, I have a Raiden processor, actually. I didn't even go for Intel, uh, which maybe was a mistake. I'm not sure. And um, it's good if you're doing a million things at once, which I am. I'm running like two streams and a side sink and a thousand things right now. Hold on, hold on. So we're gonna go with you now. This does get the discount, let me just play this. And we'll get a teleport, so it should work for this next turn. That gets discounted to cost of electrician, not bad. Um, oh, you want a round robin? I could do that. I'm going to maybe do some for, for, for this week's special. I'll be doing, I'm not going to be doing typical decks. I'm just going to be doing like, like special, special streams. I'll do OTK Cowboy. That'll be fun. Then I'll just do like tournaments and all kinds of stuff this week. Why not? Why not make it special? That's Scorch. That's fine. So we'll put this one up. So we get these teleports. This is fine. I'm, you know, we're going to start getting some treats and stuff. This teleport is free. I think trick we start off with trick or treater. And we do teleport and then a um and then a trick. We'll definitely be able to play the treat. How do you like the switch? Very nice. What the heck is this? Okay. Why? What? Scary. Give me a interdimensional zombie. Oh, got it! Really? That was amazing! I think it's better than playing this. That's weird, just to prevent the damage there. That is crazy! <laughs> Top Deck Madness! We're playing Mario Odyssey in the, in the night streams and on the new channel. It's, it's really cool. You guys should check it out. Just go watch one of the videos and see if you like it. Man. Okay, more teleports. Now what? We go with the... Tr I think we need some removal cards. So we're gonna go more with this. No real point. Is there a point in leaping things? No, we're looking for removal. That's pretty good. Clock chung. And <laughs> he doesn't want us to get any more treats. You know? So let's use teleport. What could we get that would be good here? I guess we'll leap then. And we, we got teleport? Really? This will draw us cards. I wonder if we should use it to remove one of those things. Nah, let's just draw cards. More cards! He's top decking. Oh, you're right! Oh, so we can just chump lock him to victory. He's out of cards! He spent it all on these garbage. Whoo, triplication, not bad. Not bad at all. Three cost triplication. I think I'll take it. The man's in a top deck situation. Oh, Pogo is really good here. Go for Electrician, I think so. So we can kill these two with the Pogo Electrician and then bounce this one. Uh, change of plans. So now we... Bounce this one, I believe. <laughs> just... uh, let's do it like this. More cards. Oh, oops. Oh, we're milled. We are milled right now. 
this count? Ah, uh, yeah, we're milled. Uh, actually, I'm probably gonna block. We use a teleport here for a card. No, why not? Okay. Huh? Huh? Minus five luck for what? We're doing just fine here, you guys. We're doing amazing. And <laughs> he killed that. Yay, no more time for it. Okay. Wait. Bad Moon Rising is not yet. Pogo. Uh huh. What's in the box right now? Something cheap. That's not cheap. But it doesn't work. Whoa! Look at that top deck madness! So that's, oh, this sets up the Bad Moon Rising for next turn so nicely, too. Yeah, boy! Come on, play another minion! Eh, no one cares. Durr, no one cares. <laughs> he thinks he's gonna kill this. Not even close! What a top deck! Are you just top deck battle cruiser? Are you kidding me, man? Are you kidding me, man? <laughs> it's Bad Moon Rising time yet, guys. This guy's sticking in there in the top deck situation. Bad Moon Rising! Here we go! A lot more where that came from. Oh no! <laughs> Go get him! Come on, Zombot! Finish this guy! Oh, where's the wizard? Get in my bunny! Get in my bunny! For the re oh, got to teleport in the face. Yeah, this is bullseye. <laughs> bullseye! Woo! Funny, funny wizard! I just pulled a rabbit out of the hat. <laughs> that wizard just pulled a rabbit out of his hat, yet, yeah, guys. All right, we're definitely in triple digits now. What is it? 10, 101, 101. Pretty good bad moon. Getting wizard and, and bad moon rising or in guard phase is just amazing. Okay, go. Next. Keep it going. It's going to be our last game. Uh, we'll see. Maybe I'll do I'll do I'll do this deck against you guys afterwards. So then we'll that'll continue the the theme and I'll probably just include it in the video so I'll make the outro after the PvP the PvP basically what is this deck about it's about luck it's about leaping it's so nice having both the strategy we have a conjure strategy and a leap strategy and we've been using both of them you know in different parts of different games ow ooh I just got I always get electric shocks from this because I think my sweaters on this chair creates a lot of static electricity oh it actually really hurts uh huh? Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, we'll keep three Doctor Who's, why not? Why the heck not? I think we're gonna do it like this. We want these to be more accessible than this one. And we also want a, a High Diver would be cool. High Diver or, um, or Moonwalker. Both are good on that. Uh huh? Doctor Who right now. Get him. Come on, give me something good. Piece of garbage! Seven points off. I hate that. Why does Valkyrie exist? No. Piece of trash. Stupid. Stupid. Come on, enter the me Oh, yes, got leap. Okay, good. We're good now. Now we're Gucci. Maybe we do this, and I don't think we've Doctor Who quite yet. We're gonna do this and uh, free something. Well, we'll leap this next turn. We'll pull leap redemption. We do it like this, actually. Well, do we want this Doctor Who necessarily to live one more turn? This will be at full health. Yeah. So this will this will draw a double discount card. Pretty good. We'll leap the valve. It's actually not bad. Not, not that bad anymore. I'll have to get evolutionary leap. Discount Yeti. Wow. This is gonna conjure. This is a two cost card that conjures a double discount card. I think it's worth it. Yep. Give me something good. The conjuring is real. 
This is how you ducky. Yeah, boy. Get over here. <laughs> and we'll actually leave the Valk, though. The dog is going to end up in lane one. So this ducky is going to be good to go. We got an amphibious minion. I'll take it. This is going to kill this, that one. Okay. We're still leaping the Valk. Walnut there. Okay. Hey. And go. This will still come over. Kangaroo. Uh, oh, it's in front. Okay, so it takes this out. All right. <laughs> it's kind of a waste, but whatever. That could have been so much better. Ah, bad luck. We got some good luck on the Yeti and bad luck on everything else, so. We'll add, no, we'll add one point to the Yeti. Now what? Uh, so Doctor Who's still alive, which is nice. We'll get this Yeti back. Now what do we do? Like this. Like this. This turns into three attack. Come on. Close. <laughs> that might be really dangerous. Who knows? Is there a way to make this do like a bonus attack or something? And beam me up inside. Free beam me up. I'll take it. Definitely have the card advantage. We can mix up Gravedigger coming up. That's fine. He used a croc on a 3-3. Three, three. Everything here survives. We're just going to mix up. Wait. Oh, no. We can't mix up Gravedigger, though. No. <laughs> we actually can't do play it. Come on, man. We have no plays on the ground now. <laughs> ah. That's good. That's actually pretty good. Uh, okay. It's just transformation station. Dang. 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 Everything's dying here. Wow, that was a really strong punch. Okay, this will turn to a three drop. Die. Dang! No, if we would have been able to mix up Gravedigger, ah, things would have been so much better. Then this would have also attacked and uh, I think they have right here. Plus eight. Line dancing zombie. Where does this go? I don't like that one. I think this ends beat me up. Beat me up like in four. Yeah, somewhere. We're at 20 health. We have plenty. Plenty to spare here. What the heck is that? Okay, well, we'll bounce that, obviously. Obviously! This lives. This will turn to a five. We're, we're still in great shape, actually. This does strike through. I don't know if we wanted to strike through. I think we'll take the extra damage and keep this guy alive for the Bad Moon Rising. But that. Hopefully we'll get a cheap minion here. This happens. These two will trade. We'll take four damage. We're at 16. Got plenty to go. Uh. Hmm. Cool. Uh, I think it's two and five. A really cheap trick would be good here. What's that? Is it mixed up? Yeah, it's mixed up. There we go. We still have this cosmic yeti in our hand. Our opponent, some reason, has a card advantage right now. Just need to set up a good Batman Rising. We're good. What's in the t transformation station? Mixed up is very nice. That'll survive. He's just healing. Everything's gonna survive here. Frank guitar. Okay. Wait. So everything except for the space cadet's gonna survive. This is a oh it's a oh I forgot it's a cosmic science. This is gonna give us another card here. One more card right now, kite fly or bullseye, not bad. Alright, so two of these are surviving. This turns into a six. A discotron would be like the best thing so we can set up the thing. Ah, uh, this Frank Frankie is actually gonna be really big here. Big Rock the block. The 7 5. Frank Guitar is actually really good in a conjure deck. That's interesting. I'm gonna write that deck idea down. Hmm. 
Ram Conjure Rain Tatar. Now what do we do? It's turn nine. We do not have a good Bad Moon Rising still. I think let's do this and see what happens. Let's turn into a 7-7. Seven, seven. It's not bad. It has high stats. Oh! Brontosaurus! Oh? Oh? Is that good? I think this is better, though. This is huge. This, one. this actually survives and does 6 damage bullseye to his face. This is a bullseye card. Doom Shroom! Dang! That's okay. Killed two of his guys. He killed three of mine and two of his own, so that net killed one guy. Uh, that lives. What is this guy doing? <laughs> Not Brontosaurus Rex. So we have Bronto with Kite Flyer, is pretty good. We can actually Bronto and Yeti if we want. Wow, we we got this from Cosmic Yeti. It's an amazing combo. So we do five. And we do this. What happened to Fry what me? What happened to Fry ye? You mean Fry me? Uh huh. So this dies now because of the Bronto. You already used a Doom Shroom just now. <laughs> There's that. And that's it for this thing. Okay. And plus on the block, even if he fronts us, that we're probably gonna block. I just want block super here. It's so hard to kill Walmart, you know. Uh, that's so annoying. I think we can't like again. What is this? Soup. It's so hard to crack this nut. Come on, man. Where did he get this from? Where did he even get this berry from? Dude. Dude. And also grow the Bronto. Where did he get this berry from? Oh, he stole it. He won? Oh, he procked our block and he killed us with these two. Dang. Whatever. All right, let's do some PvP. We're gonna move on from the meta to the PvP stage. Bad luck, you guys. Five points off. Now let's go. And who's next? It's Diamondula. How you doing? Think Kyle. He donated the $220 today. Thank you so much. Plus the bits. The bits are real. I realized, by the way, that PayPal um, is a... It, it actually, I do make more money from PayPal and from credit card donations. I told you guys that the credit card was the best, and that was a mistake. The credit card actually takes more than more than doing it the PayPal way, basically. Okay, what is this now? Um, something. The leap is real. Woo -hoo -hoo. <laughs> you have a good Rust Bolt stomping on deck? Yeah, well, I have several of those. Feel free to show show it to me. La, 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 la. I am so happy we have such a positive community here. Oh, I'm gonna show you guys the my guy look up look up the look up my second to last video on YouTube. If you haven't seen the Fry Me, the, the new trailer, you'll like it. Ooh, that's really good. That is amazing. That's a it's just really strong card. And the cards right now, they might be giving us an advantage. I'll give myself actually two points of luck for that. It's a 2-5. Very good stats. It's amazing stats. You just want the card with the good stats when you get this. What is this? Fry, you suck. Shut up. Okay, go, and wow. Wow, we. Okay. Thank you so much, Rizikuta. I really appreciate it. 
Very nice of you. Much appreciated. Maybe just try not to fang me during the thing. You know what I'm saying. What is this now? This is so annoying. Let's delete this. What are you doing? What do we leap? I think this will. This is gonna get out of control once we get something good right now. This is not gonna survive though. This will. Ooh, this is tough. Oh, the second channel is going just as expected, which is amazing. What do we leap here? Oh no, this is actually helping this card. Ah, uh, it's you. No! Come on, man! I ran out of time. No, I needed that. We got Deadbeard, which is pretty good. I needed that teleport, though. I needed it so badly. Leap and transform, I think. Yeah, I'm gonna try to ride this Deadbeard up. I needed this, though. Duh! Things would be different. That was weird. And... Give me something good. Yes, Frenzy. That's what I'm talking about. Wow, that's amazing, actually. Okay, this is six damage. Oh, we have Pogo now. That's good. Hopefully it doesn't look great, Buster. Kills Admiral. Thank goodness. Give me Super. I haven't even played Super yet today. Where the heck is Super? Really? Let's do that there. It's going to be Pogo. And Station. Mr. Mime! <laughs> That's cool. Okay. Mr. Mime is here. Let's do this here. Don't mess with Mr. Mime. Rockets that. That's fine. Okay, we'll bounce this now. Huh? He's moving this. That's okay. Moving it here. He's gotta bounce this. Okay, so mixed up grave digger is pretty good here. Oh, this survives! This survives! Wow! Oh, good thing we didn't play that before. <laughs> it all worked out just fine. Now mixed up grave digger actually heals this. Perfect. Gets a teleport. Now, is Mixed Up Gravedigger the play here? Or did we go for the greedy Pogo transformation station? Pogo Doctor Who? Oh, half the Mixed Up Gravedigger here. I think we're gonna go with Pogo, actually. <laughs> it's a greedy play. It would have healed this, but I guess I don't think transformation station is really good anywhere, so. Use that as a distraction. Actually, we don't want the pogo in the in the in the thing. That's weird. Flicking that. That's okay. This is fine. Mixed up grave digger is still good. Please don't block. Yes. Okay. So this goes down. Th oh no. Oh. Oh, he flicked it. Oh, I see. So that died. Okay. Well, that's fine. I'm gonna go with Pogo again now. Bad Moon Rising is coming up. Be nice to play two minions here. I'm gonna have to bounce this though. It's weird, but we're gonna do it like this. See what happens. Your commands are outdated. A little bit. Life is fry, the fry eyed human, but human is human. So confused. Huh? Soul patch. Now we bounce. Definitely bounce soul patch. Okay, so this prevents us from getting the five damage this turn, which is good. Dang. <laughs> this card up. Now, see, now we have mix of Gravedigger, bounce, bounce. 
Ooh, please don't get Guy. No, come on. Come on. No, we needed that double bounce. That was so lucky. Just get super something. Why? We're not getting anything out of this now. We needed that extra card there. This is not going well, you guys. I guess five and two now. Okay. Some transformation station here. Ah, not good. A soul patch. Make a pl plan. Well, we're definitely bouncing the soul patch here. Doing two damage to us. There's no point. In I guess we have another one, so why not? Just in case. Ah. Uh, could really use another pogo, actually. Down to six. Oh. Uh, Either this and either Bad Moon Rising or Helicopter. Helicopter could be amazing. He's gonna have that, um. He's gonna have that Soul Patch. Give me something good. Rocket Science. Let's go. Rocket, rocket, rocket. Rocket. Crap. Sorry for being late. I had to do some Christmas Eve cleaning. What's everyone's favorite quote from Fry this year? Have a happy holidays, everyone, and Thank let's you. watch Fry Rep this Caratina D. <laughs> Just when he says that, let's guarantee lethal on the other side. <laughs> no, not Dragon. <laughs> Good game. Who was that? That was Think Kyle. Good game. Think Kyle. And thank you so much, sorry, but thank you so much, Chocolate Chip Donuts, for this. Uh, wow. So much happening on the stream today. It's so much happening. Alright, who's next? This, that was a PvP game. <laughs> Good game, Finka. Come on, man. Piece of dragon garbage. It does kind of feel like the Bad Moon Risings are not that good because they don't have enough small minions. I should actually take out the Bad Moons from this deck and add in just something else random. Um. Let's look for something a little earlier. No. Yeah, boy, finally started with super. This is the first time, this might be the first time we're even playing, I think it's the second time we're playing this stream, and definitely the first time we've started with this out of all these games. So that's a lot of luck right there. Three points. There you go, especially with all this. Look at this garbage here. Now what do we do? Is this gonna survive? Go! Lele! Lele! Leap this? Leap actually is not a bad play. We're gonna do this. Should we set up the chemist? We could. What does he grow shrooms? No, that's kind of grow shrooms. Peapod. And Torchwood? Black IP only. No! Not Black IP. Why? Not nice. I feel like this. I should have leaked this. I should have been the play. <laughs> Got him! Doctor Who being self-sufficient. Ooh, Nebula. Not bad. Huh. Gonna ramp the Bad Moon Rising, you guys. Let me do this in Nebula here. Nebula right now. Go. 
go. Block. So we're gonna draw uh, one card that's double discounted. Give me something good, please. Yes! Whoa! Whoa! Ho, ho, ho! Everything just changed! Everything just changed! New strategy, you guys. We'll, we'll play that. Why not? We'll play this right here. Everything just changed. We're gonna do this and thinking cap actually. Go! Wait! We can thinking cap, we can leap, we can leap that we can we leap the warlord if we want. We're probably gonna end up leaping the warlord and getting even more brains this turn. What just happened? Huh? Okay. There's a bonus attack. Oh. Ow. Okay, so this still works. We'll still be able to leap after this. It's in the box. Lightning bolt powers. We got lightning bolt powers. Let's leap this one. It's in the box. Yes! <laughs> Battle Cruiser! That's what I'm talking about. Ah! Let's freeze this one. This still dies, so we can lightning bolt something here. I think it's just lightning bolt this one. Because it's annoying. <laughs> we actually have mixed up Gravedigger here. The mixed up Gravedigger is real. Do we want to leap this though again? No, we want to mix up Grave Digger. What if he has Grave Busters though? These guys have Grave Busters? Nah, he's not running Grave Blaster. We'll just... Go! Plus, we'll get more cheese. Yeah, okay, that's dead. This draws a card. Uh, yep. Then protect that. Okay, that happened. Yes! Wow! <laughs> I'm just coming down from the. This is so complicated. I think it's mixed up Gravedigger here. This is the- everything's buffed by Warlord still, by the way. We're gonna do it like this, I believe. Now, if he has a Grave Blaster, uh, it's gonna be really bad. Come on, we need- we need the-, the, the this to be in, in- what's it called? In four again. And no. Three, no. Two, okay. Low average. Yes! Oh no. Oh no. Oh no! Ow. Here's that. We are protected! And... Okay, it's bullseye. Wait, so this overshoot... It's... Hmm. I don't think we're playing this anywhere. Well, should we play here? No. No, I don't play anywhere. Okay, so overshoot. Uh, this is very likely lethal, actually. In fact, I'm pretty sure it's guaranteed lethal. I'll get, he get that, that, he needs, no, super doesn't help. That doesn't help. Yeah, it's lethal. Got him. <laughs> it's lethal. It's seven plus four because the overshoot proc the block. Oh, wait, yeah, yeah, that doesn't matter. Because this is bullseye anyway. Ah, uh, that was fun. <laughs> Alright guys, that was the R and Jesus stream. You saw me play against the meta in ranked mode and you saw me play a couple PvPs there. That was amazing. The final score is 121. 121 to 45. We always have good luck.